Volusia County Golf Course that could cost taxpayers more than a million dollars to renovate may have more problems than leaders expected. Channel 9's Blaine Tollison learned a state inspection found significant violations, including inside the golf course restaurant. He's been working to find out who's to blame. Port Orange is facing tough questions about whether to keep the private managers of its public golf course. Now that the company failed to mention a 2014 state health inspection, it found several violations including animal droppings and dead roaches in the golf course restaurant, something the company's own evaluations had reviewed and reported as good. Will the city continue using them? Well, certainly we will ask them to address the problem and we'll see what kind of response we get. At Cypress Head, an employee agreed to speak with us at first. Your report said the inspection was good and the state inspection found rat droppings and dead roaches. How was that? Don't answer. Don't answer. Don't answer anything. No answer for that question. Absolutely not. The golf club did hire a pest control company and took other actions to comply with state standards. Between a poor health inspection here and the results of that inspection not being shared with city leaders, some residents are questioning the transparency at this facility and whether it should get 1.6 million taxpayer dollars for a renovation. We should have, have heightened concern that if they have withheld this information, what else are they withholding from us? The city has budgeted for the renovation, but it has not been given final approval. In Port Orange, Blaine Tallis and Channel 9 Eyewitness News. We're learning more about the man.